I never had faith in the system, but after Trump got elected, it kind of restored a little bit of that, I think, in a lot of people. I really can't even fathom the amount of doublespeak and wrong think and self-censoring that's going on these days. When, while they were screaming manufactured crisis at the border, and there was in fact an influx of immigrants crossing the border, the Democrats denied funding, you know, for food and diapers and shit like that at the border 17 times until people started dying. Then they started screaming how there's a crisis at the border. It's Trump's fault. That was nuts. Check this out. <laughs> like, who are these people? Oh, yay! Dude, 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 yay! He wants to fuck Trump. Dude, come on. Remember this? Would someone dressed up as a as a a rodeo clown dressed up as Obama? He like lost his job. Remember that? Can't make fun of Obama, but you sure can make fun of Trump all you want. Severed heads and all. Who was that? Kathy O'Griffin cut his head off. She she did apologize for it, but uh, <laughs> it just goes to show Trump has been the most transparent president. He has a Twitter account that he knows how to use. Some say that uh, they want him to stop tweeting, but he's like, you know, the president of the free world, so you kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of have to just let him do it. Obama <laughs> hated free speech. Look, Obama used the Espionage Act more than any president before him combined. This is a funny little article. And Trump could be even worse. Well, 2017... He got about three years later, he hasn't used it once. But Obama, well, Trump has pardoned some of the whistleblowers and uh, people that, or Trump had pardoned the people that Obama put in jail. But, I mean, you know, it's just kind of projection much? Projection much? Yeah, I believe so. You can see here that Obama actually deported more people than President Trump. And this is true. Hopefully Trump is getting close to that record. He's been, you know, there for three years or whatever. But, you know, this necessarily isn't a bad thing. I actually like this about Obama. I remember when, well, it usually only takes a small amount of people, but one liberal sect of people, I can't remember what they were called, got all pithy about uh, immigrants, illegal immigrants crossing the border being jailed with their children. So they create a facility for to separate the children from the jails. And that's kind of like where the whole issue started. But and I think it was better to have a separate facility for the children because a lot of the time the people weren't even the parents of the kids to come to find out. Um, so that was I thought that was a good move as far as for Obama. I mean, his unsanctioned wars and stuff like that was not very good. You know, bombing children's hospitals and, you know, Punisher style wedding ceremonies in, in Yemen. Not a big fan of those, but wasn't a big fan of the, you know, the whole thing in Syria either, but that was false flag. What can you do? What can you do?